Guys, welcome back to our final attempt on the money box. So this has changed quite a bit since you've seen it last. The last time we were here, this thing was a lot thicker. It went up. Unfortunately, a big portion of it fell on them when I wasn't here. So they recreated it and gave it for, since this is our going to be our official last try, $7,500. Some of the money has came out of it, but there's still a big portion. There was 25,000 over that. There's still a large amount in here, and I hope that there's a large amount because this is officially our $7,000 attempt. Uh, they cut $500 off of it, so it was 2,000 for the last. We still get 10 minutes, try to win what we can win. This tower should come down without a problem. Added to today is two mystery bags that can have some extra money, even if I just win those. So we are back. Hopefully this works out to be a good video for all of us. The uh, first one, I did part one and two. As you know, I, I forgot about the volume. I'm definitely making sure the volumes come through on this. But let's get in position. 10 minutes. Got to win what we can win. All right, guys, here we go. What I want to do and what I was told that happened is the money box that's in the back fell down just sitting there and it pushed everything over. So I know on the old setup, if that happened, then it's definitely got to happen on this one. There's a lot of money. There's, uh, let's see, 1000 2000 $3,000 just a, on top of the tower and then the portion below has all the thousand and five hundred chips in that so this should be a big one oh man I like to see what actually got that money box off because Lord knows I played it three times already and I can't get it to come down. So I'm gonna see if I can just pile this thing up to come down like that. Oh, in it! In it! What? Oh, and it all stayed in. That is very very lucky we did not lose any of the chips that are on top i'll do a quick readjustment because this thing is really all right so we have seven thousand dollars in total zero dollars back so we definitely we, we can't afford i can't afford that is not a way you know, just being not even April yet, and being that far in debt is not a not a good way to start. <laughs> so um, I don't like to add both of these things together. That should be huge. It is Easter weekend. Um, I don't want to talk about Easter and gambling. They, those two things should not go hand in hand whatsoever. Talking about the resurrection of the Lord and gambling. But gambling aside, taking all that aside, not, not looking at what I'm doing right now. Happy Easter to everybody. I hope you can have a good weekend with your family and loved ones. Enjoy the holiday. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of your Easter weekend with, with me. I'll try not to take up too much of your time, but I want to make it worth your time. All right, so we got all the cash down except the 500. We definitely need to get that money box to come down so we can get So, uh, 
I don't know if it's just me, but theme songs from the 80s and early 90s to TV shows, I really feel like they were very catchy. Um, there's so many of them that just uh, throughout my, there, and they're all officially down. Um, just, I'll start randomly singing it, but uh, one of them that I heard today, and I can't stop singing, and from the 19, what is it, 83, 80, ooh, that's not good. Oh, 1983, 84 series, Reading Rainbow. I cannot get that song out of my head. It's, it's on repeat in my skull, in my brain. Butterflies in the sky. <laughs> it's in a book. Take a look. Reading Rainbow. Big part of my childhood right there. Leave me a comment. What what's uh what's a TV sitcom that if you hear the theme song or think about it, it brings you back to your childhood. Time is not on my side. Uh, if we can get this box, it's getting super close to coming off. We need it, get it down. That is really the only way I can see that we're gonna get this. Though. I'm gonna try to fill this up as much as I possibly can. All right. Come on, baby, get the thing off there. That's the only way we're gonna be able to do this, that's for sure. I just wanna keep on. Not giving the chance to fall backwards, just keep getting pushed up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that was not. Arr, it's down. It's heading into the right direction. But honestly, man, that could have. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Keep pushing up. Keep pushing up. Keep pushing up. Come on, money box. going on here with this setup this thing because it's it's almost there guys but we're almost there on time too it's about an inch away from touching the back of the tower. I mean, we, we it would ideally get that big quarter to come down and use that for leverage to push against the money box, but it doesn't seem like it wants to make it over to the hump. And even if it does, I think it might be facing in the wrong direction. The other big problem that we're running into is none of the cash is moving up. The 500,000 just seems like they're stuck still. Come on. It's having a problem with my stinking tooth. I, um, my top, <clears throat> my top teeth the left side just that particular side I've had so many issues no other teeth none none in my mouth they think it's from the way I grind my teeth at night uh, but I've done had two root canals up there I broke a tooth off 
that they had to get fixed and then that's when all that issue I had with the dentist that did a horrible job and did all that damage and now I'm having I think I need another root canal okay well yeah thank you all right two minutes that's actually giving us a little bit extra time but two minutes is still nothing I, I don't know what's going to happen here I really don't the other problem is now that it's so stinking empty on the back shelf I'm not getting as big a push from the quarters and come on baby come on come on come on come on come on come on oh that quarter on the left is almost down but I don't think that's going to be in a position that's going to help us out much oh gosh guys I think it's getting ready to come, guys. And what do we do? I'm playing till they stop me. Goodness gracious, that thing is getting a tilt to it. What, a minute? A minute? Okay, all right, well, we're down to a minute. I think I'm getting a little bit of help. Oh my gosh, I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh, that came down. I don't know. See if I can get a extra big push behind it. There we go. Oh, oh no! There we go. There we go. Oh, oh no! Do we have enough time? This. Okay. All right. This is it, guys. Oh. All right. This is it. Oh. All right. This is it, guys. Oh. I am out of quarters. Hopefully something good comes out of this. I don't know. I think we may have got some money from. All right, so I'll let this circle. Let's see what happened here. Oh my goodness gracious. Guys, so, um, they cleared out for me. I'm not exactly sure how well we done, we have done, but one thing I do know for sure is that we did get something out of it. Uh, they told me if something falls until I'm done, I can have it. So I'm really, really hoping that that is so close and that you can't really tell, but that's a big pile of money that's sitting right there. Ooh, okay, well this actually Looks a little promising, I think. All right. All right, so let's, let me put that to the side. All right, guys, so as you know, there was 500 chips and there was 1,000 chips. We are $7,000 invested, so we need 7,000 to get our money back. Let's go ahead and see how well we've done. There's 1,000. 2,000, 3,000, ah, 4,000, 4,500, that's all for 500, 45, 55, 65, oh my gosh, and $7,500, that is officially it. So I am going to sit here for a few moments just to see, but that puts us 7,500, thanks to the fact that our last buy-in was only 2,000 and not 2,500, that officially puts us up $500. I tell you what, 
after the way things were working out, if that's all that we get, I'm happy. I'm just happy to be in the green. Uh, all right, guys, listen, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, hopefully part two was a lot more entertaining than part one. I had so many problems with the volume going out and everything else. So hopefully this made up for it. If you, oh, waiting. <laughs> Uh, if, if you enjoyed today's video, you can show me by hitting that like button. If you are watching on Facebook, I'd love to have you follow the page and come part of our family. I'm trying to get to 500,000 followers, guys. If you're watching on YouTube, love you have you hit that subscription button. Whether you're watching on YouTube or Facebook, if you hit that like and share the video, that is literally like giving me a huge tip, and I greatly appreciate it. Thank you all so much. Have a wonderful Easter. Take care of yourself, and uh, I will definitely talk to each and one of you all very soon. Thanks to every one of the UVIPs on Facebook. I can't do this without your all's help. Have a good day, guys.